Hello everybody, I'm Ivor Rabbit. We're here on Beam NG with probably my new favorite drift car other than the OG Chaser. This BMW M2 competition with some drift suspension and modified wheels and tires. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media, all which you find in the description box below. Let's get to it. So we're going to go full send on this. There's not many mods that i found that just adding a drift steering ratio and drift tires on it make the car handle super well. And that's why I absolutely love this M2 competition. As we about uh, right off the car in our first, uh, first lap around this kart track. Ball tap. I mean, we decided to rip the bumper off on our first out here at the car track, which is totally okay. As you can see, this car. We almost go to the wall. It's super fun to drive. And it handles quite well. Oh, until you go off course. For, oh, given the uh, fact that it is just a modded car with just quick drift steering angle steering, and it's, uh, that's quite good. Ooh. Oh, we broke a wheel. We definitely broke our front wheel there. Yeah, we definitely broke that. Well, we're going to have to hit refresh on that. Go take a go onto the map and find another place where we can go full full drift send. What is this? This relic that's rally cross. There's not many uh places on this track that we could go but we could go to the mini circuit here and then of course we'll probably change up tracks quick travel there probably a little second gear rip rip course third this car really likes third except for like in those turns it does not <clears throat> like I said, for a basic mod that was not designed for drifting, it's quite fun. We're gonna not make that. Nope. I mean, if we're gonna, if we're gonna test this car out. Might as well bring it over here. And do some jump drifts. Make sure we have our traction control and everything off. I'm not sure how this is going to work. But overall, not doing too bad in this car. Shoot that! Just a little dirt drop, nothing major. We're not gonna make that. Oh. Let go of the wheel. Yep, we kind of uh, smacked the front of the car. I don't think we did really any damage, so we're gonna go full stem for the jump drift. I don't think we damaged the car. We're gonna find out. Oh. oh, I don't have the brake set at all. Chatter the wheel. Okay. Well, we. Oh, we definitely wrecked the car now. Oh, man. We're going to go hit that respawn a new car. And we're going to go check 
the brakes on this and tuning brake multiplier I don't think we can adjust our brake and nope it does not look like we can adjust our brake nope we're just gonna have to go full send with this how it is I've already rode off the car twice in this episode, which is bound to happen. There's no real left foot braking here in beam, I've noticed. Ooh, I almost had that. Now we're gonna go full send again. That was not really a jump drift. We weren't fast enough, but we managed to make the track without dying. So that's a plus. We're just going to have to go full send from this corner section with as much speed as possible. And uh, hope we can uh, just full send it. There we go. Oh no. I was just I was not gonna hold on to that. <laughs> oh man. Um Yeah. I would love to get a full full jump drift with this thing with a little bit of a wall tap. But unfortunately, that's gonna be a lot harder than I thought. Because when we hit any type of dirt or any bump, the car gets so unsettled. Oh, that was almost it. The chatter at lock with this wheel is insane. Being on a 21 newton meter wheel is definitely... Uh, not an easy task when it hits that lock and starts to give you that chatter. You see it in my hands. It's uh, could be very dangerous. I probably should turn my force feedback down some to help prevent that. I'm gonna give it another go here. This is a lot harder than I expected it to be. I mean, I didn't expect it to be easy, but also this car is not a, not the easiest when it comes to uh, doing jump drifts. Probably definitely not set up for this, but what fun is it if we're not uh, going full send? Well, let's grab the drift car and see if we can complete a jump drift with that car because we know that car is designed to be going sideways. So apparently I do not have the right textures. I may have an incorrect mod or something installed with this mod because you can see my textures are a little off on this drift car. But we're gonna go full sem with it one time to end this episode off. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll let you find the description box below. If you guys are still enjoying Beam content, let me know down below as well. That was not the best, but I mean, we kind of did it. Let me show you guys Hello, Will Channer. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. All your found in the description box below. Big things coming this week and an announcement that I'll be making. So make sure you follow me on Instagram as well as on here on the channel. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.